Okay, um, I just want to share a couple of things from a PD I just went to. Um, this first one is magnificent. Uh, it's a quick way to use Word to check the language level of anything you're giving your students. So this crosses over to, to all subjects, I think. Um, I'll just go... If you ask your student to do an assignment on earthquakes, for example, they might go to Wikipedia. Um, now, if I just copy the text from Wikipedia, um, and you might use this to copy text from anywhere, but as soon as the text is in Word, like so, uh, you can now check the language level of that text. Okay, to do that, you just select all the text like that. Um, under the Review tab, so normally you'd be in Home, under the Review tab is your Spelling and Grammar. Um, and if you go to Options on the Spelling and Grammar, um, what you need to tick, which I've already done, is Show Readability Statistics. Um, so that's the key one, Show Readability Statistics. Click on OK. Um, and then basically I'll ignore all this stuff which is spelling problems and words it doesn't recognize. Uh, no, okay. This is what we're interested in. In the last screen you get readability statistics. So you get a word count and characters, paragraphs, sentences, etc. which may be useful to you. Um, but the very interesting one here is the Flesh Kincaid grade level. So if you look at grade 12 as basically year 12 here, what it's saying is that this Wikipedia is at a reading level of year 12. Uh, the reading ease is out of 100. So what this is saying is that this thing that you get straight from Wiki, which a lot of our students go to from year I'm not sure if they do it in primary school, but certainly in secondary school, Wiki is one of the first places they get to. Uh, the reading age is way beyond the average middle school student, and the reading ease, 39.8 um, is quite low. It should actually be up towards 100. Um, it also gives you, well, sorry, an easy passage will be up towards 100. Uh, it also gives you other information, uh, words per sentence, sentences per paragraph, which could be handy. Uh, but I found this fascinating and very, very useful, and I'm sure you'll be able to apply it in your class as well. Okay. Um, it, it may be useful um, to check any text that you're going to give to your students that it is an appropriate reading age. Um, it it also be interesting, I think, for students to uh, to motivate them to try and lift their the reading age of what they write as they increase in sophistication um, and ability. Uh, I'm sure you'll come up with many other ways to use it as well, but very interesting and very useful.